Northeast Florida is a special place. It is full of history, beautiful landscapes, and redfish. Hungry, angry, unpredictable redfish. If you plan your day right, you'll see these fish come alive like never before. But of course, Mother Nature loves to throw a wrench in the best laid plans. Timing today is crucial. If we aren't at the right spot at the right time, we'll be left high and dry. But there is a sweet spot on both the incoming and the outgoing tide. And if we time it just right, the redfish will be ready to party. So the goal is to make it to that party on time. Captain Jonathan Moss, presented by Florida Fishing Products. late start this morning. How enjoyable is that? Yeah, man, I'm not used to this tide deal. Dude, Normally that's what happens when you, got, when you got low tides. We got to work around them. Well, come on, she's ready. Let's do it. Well, John, it's fall, buddy. Yeah, it's fall, which means the fish are moving. They're happy. They're crawling around the back. They're not going to be happy in a little bit. Well, let's go, let's go plug oh, a couple hooks in. Oh, yeah, we'll put a couple <laughs> hooks in their face. They won't be too happy with us. I'm gonna tell you what, I think we got a little bit of cloud cover moving in, and that should really help stir these fish up, get them up off the bottom. Uh, we're gonna really be looking for them tailing and backing in schools as they fall out on the outgoing tide. And then as soon as we swap to the incoming tide, they should be crawling up shallow to try to get to the crabs and shrimp. Awesome, and we're, we're really waiting for that flood tide. Oh, the flood tide this evening should be a monster as long as the storms don't end. Come up our area, you can fish the bottom of the lows looking for them crawling those top of those highs this time of year and really try to find them feeling up in the Spartina grass. Well, I've never done the flood tide, so I'm still experienced. Well, I'm going to tell you what, buddy. It's going to be awesome. You're in, you're in for a treat. It's be good. You're in for a real treat. Come on, let's get there. <laughs> let's do it. That's the, there's a nice school right there. Okay, we'll come back yeah, to this spot. Yeah, going away from us down the line there. Yeah, you see them right there? Yeah. Still busting bait. There's a bunch of shrimp right there they're chucking, they're chewing on, okay? That was another school I tried to get to feed the other day. We'll come back to this spot in just a minute. We'll let it run a little drier. I'm not gonna be able to get up there in a minute. See, they're still going in that pocket. They're actually tipping their tails right here at one o'clock against that bank. Up in here? Yep, right there. You can just barely make him out right now. See it right there? There's his tail. See that little see that little ripple, John? I see it. I see it. I don't want you to hit him. Ooh. Oh, big eat oh. right there. <laughs> that was sick, dude. All right, let's go feed him this plastic. <laughs> I told you to, oh look at him just yeah. popping shrimp left and right. If we if we can stay without hitting them, we should be able to see their tails pop up, okay? Oh, you hear him around the corner? Pump me up just a little bit. I think there's some coming right at us. There's some, some right around the corner. There's one right there, shoot. That's right, there should be a group right around the corner here. Yeah, I can't get any further in there. I, I want you to take a shot dead out in the center here. Yeah. 
and then I'm gonna turn this out before we end up living back here, all right? Hey, John, this is what I've been seeing all freaking day, okay? So that is not the last crew we're gonna have run into like that. The Captain's Log with Captain Jonathan Moss, presented by Florida Fishing Products, is brought to you by Florida Fishing Products, Icon Coolers, Denko Flyers, Temple Fork Outfitters, Skinny Water Culture, and Go Castaway Fishing Charters. shallow water. Problem is, as you can see, you got about two inches of visibility. So if you're not dead on their nose, forget it. I have a feeling there's a few more back up in here. Swimming right. There he is. Did Ooh. you see that? <laughs> that must have been 10 feet from the boat. Dude, that, that might have been the one I saw coming straight down that bank. He is hooked. Oh, oh, oh. kinds of funny. I saw that. Alright, bring him right in the pot. Oh man, look at all that mud on you. <laughs> coming at you, coming at you. Let's see. Let's see. Yes, sir! <laughs> He's gonna be full of spunk, man. We, he ate it right at the boat. Let's not hurt you too bad, girl. There you go. Oh, look. You know, look how it got turned around. Oh. It ate it. Oh, it she smoked it. it. She smoked it. All right, John. Dude, I see I'm some. Like... I see some bigger girls way back up in there. You're shaking, bro. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you what. That rain definitely, I think, it, I think it gave them just what they needed to get fired up today. Well, from sitting at the dock for an hour getting pounded by the rain <laughs> to now putting fish in the boat, dude, that is a uh, complete 180, but the 180 in the direction we wanted to go. I was about to say. <laughs> go on. All right, let's get another one. All right, John, he's right at 11 o'clock. See him tipping up? Get ready. Get ready. This is a happy fish. See the tail? He's right at 11. He's facing slightly. See the tail? It's popping up. He's going over to the left. There's two of them. There's two of them, and that's a giant. But you put it past him and bring it to him, okay? Bring it, bring it. Where is he? Where is that fish? Yeah, heading to the right. I, he might be heading to the right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You might be just too far to the left of him. Ooh, oh, did he eat it? He's still with it. Put it back on him, put it back on him. Bring it, bring it. Hey, wait, a little titty. Oh, he's going to the left. He was trying to eat it. He doesn't know. He's just trying to search for it. Put it over left of him. Bring it in, that might come in on his side. He's going up to the left, he's going up to the bank. See him right here on the bank? That's it. Twitch it. Twitch it, he turned on it. 
Is he eating it? Nope, he just found something else to eat. Bring it up. Oh, come on, fish, it's in your face. Put it a little bit to the right of it. Oh. Did you see that? No. That was so sick. No. no. Did you see you come up and slurp it? On it. That's okay. That was cool. That was very, very cool. <laughs> Did we at least they get just that? slurped and they came right at me. Oh my god. That's why I didn't get a hook in them. Oh my god. This is what we've been waiting for, brother. We've been dodging storms all day. We got just a short amount of time on the outgoing, and now we got the flood tide. We've been dodging storms. We got a rainbow over here. We got storms in front of us, storms to our right. Let's see if we can pick one up on the fly, bro. And I'm gonna tell you what. And they're popping. I can keep we hearing them We waited popping. all day for this right here, John. I told you, you give me an hour, we're gonna see plenty of fish well, here on the that's flood That's all we got. We don't even have an hour with the sun dropping and the rain's coming back. <laughs> No, we don't, but I'm gonna tell you, as we approach this flat here, I've got multiple fish up on the surface. Uh, I want you to keep an eye out for heads bobbing, right tails here. up. Right here. At, They're all feeding on crabs out here, right here, okay? There's 11, one at 12, at one there. Just get ready, I got two fish right, right close, right close. Are the rainbow? Yep. I'm like trying to give you a crash course really fast in this. We're going from zero to 60, no wake up oh, time. Right See here. all the, right yeah, right there's right three here. of them right there. Wait, 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 little tick, now tick, wait. Tick, 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 tick. Got him, got him. Nice. Oh man, <laughs> that is what I've been wanting to do for a long time. We've been dodging rain all day, bro. Oh my God. All to lead to that right there. That's what I'm talking about, buddy. That was buddy. sick. That I appreciate your patience about. on crash course running through. We got 10 minutes on this tide before the rain hits us again. That was so sick, dude. Buddy, we have we have played with some pretty awful conditions today. This is what it makes it all Woo! worthwhile. On the flood, bro, I've wanted to do this oh. for years. Now I'm gonna tell you, I have a tradition of getting in for everybody's first day. Okay, I'll, whatever you want. Bring it right in. Wow. <laughs> that is what we did. That's a beautiful fish right there. All day. Waiting for this moment. We've had storms on and off all day, fighting that, fighting tides. Finally got what we're looking for, brother. Dude, I will tell you, it's one of the most magical things about St. Augustine. Man. Right here. Taylor's in the grass, buddy. Bro, all right. Last time we fished, you said we got to get you back to the flood tide, and it, this is worth it. <laughs> Even if it's only an hour. <laughs> <laughs> God. Oh, that was beautiful. See him right there? See the ripples? 12 o'clock. He's moving to the I left. Him. I got him. I got him. You're short. Just a hair. A little bit longer for me, buddy. Good. Wait. Take it. Take it now. Nope, he's over to the he's over to the left more. Or sorry, to the right more. Strip it, strip it. Hey, got him. As soon as it hit the water. As soon as it hit the water. Oh my. <laughs> How perfect was that? How perfect was that, dude? That was so sick. Stay tight with him. Don't let him don't let him rip out, wrap you up on the grass real quick. Oh. Uh, right, here's what we're gonna do. You've worked too hard today. I'm gonna land this fish, and then we're gonna swap. Dude. And you're gonna come up here, and you're gonna stick one. I cannot wait. What do you it's think been about a minute. that, bro? It's been a minute since I plugged one in the face. Ooh, that looks like a nice fish. It's a good fish. 
There we go. Finally, some grown girls in the grass. I can dig that. Well, I learned something a long time ago. Every fish is a good fish. Some are just bigger than others. And I don't care what they, what size they are. To take one on a topwater eat in the flood on fly, buddy, dude, that was sick. I can tell you right now, any fish in the flood is a good fish, especially when it they're feeding on top like that. Inhaled it. That fly is gone. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah, that's a good fish for me to end on. Just a swap. Oh, I don't think this is the last one of the day, though, buddy. Oh, no, no, I'm saying for me to go to the back. Oh. <laughs> Time for you to stick one. Dude, Beauty. that is a the beautiful fish. That fly is gone. St. Augustine floods, buddy. I remember several months ago, I went to your Old City fly shop, and we did a fly tying night. And what fly did I teach? The gurgler. The gurgler. And what are we out here and Here we are. With? Fishing with the gurgler. Fishing with the gurgler. He inhaled it. Got it. <laughs> that gurgler is destroyed. Gone. All right. Chunky. Beauty. All right. Back in the water she goes, brother. That water's cooled off after that rain, too, brother. Uh, I'm sure these fish are nice and happy with yeah. the new water temps. Love it. Absolutely love it. All right. John. The swap. Great casting, buddy. Hey, thank you. Great casting. Thanks for the push. Yeah, he's right there. He's coming to us. I see him. Yep. Get ready. Here he comes. Just to your right. He's on it. Oh, he kicked for it. But Turned he didn't off grab of it. it. Matt, you got one right here at 10 o'clock. How far out? Right there. Oh, I see him. Good throw, dude. There it is. That was sick, dude. That was beautiful. There we go. Absolutely beautiful. Ooh. I bet that feels good up there, huh? That feel nice. I almost forgot what that hey, feels you've like. You earned it, bro. You worked hard today. I'm gonna tell you what, John. Despite the rain and everything else, it's always a magical day having you on the boat. Hey, bro. I appreciate that. Oh. What a way to end our day. A couple of nice fish right there, too. I mean, not. Not giants, but healthy, healthy. I mean, look at the bellies on this thing. There's been plenty of shrimp out here today for Ah, uh, I think there's plenty. <laughs> We've seen so many shrimp popping. Woo, there we go. Come on, baby girl. Excellent, dude, beautiful. What you think, John? You wanna help me out real quick? Oh, look at there. The colors, the eat. They say picking one of these things up kind of like riding a bike. Hey, <laughs> you haven't missed a day, brother. I hope not. Didn't look like it. I hope not. What John. a way to end our, our day, brother. Thanks for a push. Oh, no, thank Thanks. you for the push. You earned it. Oh. See, when, when I get up on the platform, you catch fish like that. Hey. See? You know what? It, that, it, was all, it was all you. If you didn't coach me in on that one, I don't know what I would have done. Oh, man. <laughs> all right, well, let's get her unbuttoned. Let her go. And yeah. Sun's setting. We'll run back to the dock before it gets dark. Yeah, or another rain shower. Or uh, these no seams pick me up and take me back. <laughs> oh. Awesome. Oh, she didn't wait long. Gone she goes, brother. Hey. Dude, what a day. What an absolute amazing we got day. A beautiful sunset into the clouds. We got a few more fish here. Let's pull our way out, head to the dock, and call it a day. Sounds like a good, sounds like a good plan. You want to go catch some dinner? Let's go catch some Let's dinner. Let's go do <laughs> And now, the Tackle Box Tip with Captain Jonathan Ross, presented by Icon Coolers. Today we fished the flood tide. We started with the low incoming, and then we transitioned to the flood tide. This setup from TFO, this is the 7.6 medium tactical inshore, paired with the Florida Fishing Products Bahia 3000, 15 pound braided line, 20 pound leader, and then if you wanted to do, you know, just throw spin on the flood tide, this setup, the owner twist lock and a DOA cow that will keep you weedless that will get the bites I you know me I love 
that lure for just about anything in shore. If you want to throw fly, we were throwing an eight weight. You could get away with a six or a seven. This is an eight weight. This is the mangrove coast from TFO. I got a floating line with a weight forward and my fly of choice. One of my favorite flies. It's a great fly if you want to go inshore or even bass fishing with it. The gurgler. Now listen, this hook does ride down, and, but it goes through that grass without any issues. Plop, plop, looks like a shrimp up on the surface, and they come up and hammer it. Absolutely love it. Easy to tie, simple materials, great fly inshore, and especially that explosion on the flood tides. Today was tough. We had a window of time to hit the low tide and the flood tide. We knew that if we got there, we'd find the fish and crush them. Unfortunately, Mother Nature had other plans, which resulted in a much smaller window of time to work with. Pressure was on, and we were both feeling it. But sometimes when the clock is winding down and you have to deliver, there's an added level of excitement and maybe even a bit of an adrenaline rush. And wow, what an ending. Today we dodged rain. We got caught in the rain. We ran from it. Needless to say, our hope for success was hanging by a thread. But by the grace of God, we had a window. We went for it and amazingly prevailed. A hard-fought, hard-earned day that will live amongst the memories recorded in the captain's log.